Um, yeah, I mean, I like it. <laughs> I have luck, and uh, all I need is a bridge, really. Kind of helps that my opponent plays an Urborg. Hey, look at that, a bridge. I thought he that Ulamog. So all I need is my opponent not to draw another Ulamog. And I see one map, and I see the second map, and that tells me that my opponent drew a map for the turn. So now I just play out the uh, lock and I'm good to go. Keep the decay on top because uh, I want to be able to kill that relic. I do need to get rid of that eye so my opponent can't go search up an Ulamog, but my opponent still has a map. And if I do it before my opponent pops the map, then uh, yeah, I want to force my opponent to use that relic now. Um, yeah, if I do it before my opponent pops the map, then <clears throat> he can just search up another eye and I can lose, so. Now I can safely destroy the eye, get my third land, play bridge, and uh, that's pretty much game. Yeah, and I got a surgical on top, so I'm just gonna surgical Ulamog and that'll really be game. So opponent concedes. It's a really cool deck, I love that deck. I might just build it for my son. Except for the Ulamogs, of course. Those things are expensive. Uh yeah, pretty good hand. Um I have spell skite that'll help me keep bridge safe. But opponent sided in this card it looks like on my bridge, so that was a sad day. But hey, look, I drew another bridge. I don't want to pop the stirrings quite yet. Yeah, I could have taken the relic, but the silver was really the only threat. So if I draw, uh, I was thinking about popping the stirrings there, but I decided not to. Because if my opponent draws into another discard, I'm going to need that stirrings. So now I do the stirrings, grab that lantern, and all I need is for the card in my opponent's hand to be dead, and I'll be okay. I do need to worry about that eye, of course, still. He could use it to go get a uh, an Ulamog. But I'm doing okay. I don't want my opponent to have that Inquisition. <laughs> Fortunately, it's just another map on top. The good news is I have Ghost Quarter on top too, so I can use that to take out the eye. Play the spell sky at first so I can prevent some damage there. My opponent doesn't know I have bridge, I don't think so. He tries to go all aggro route. Now my opponent still has map in hand, so doing ghost quarter will just tell my opponent to hey go get another eye, and I don't want that. So all I've got to do is prevent uh, future threats and let my opponent play out all of his options he thinks he has. There goes that map. And 
I can draw the bridge, that way in some random chance my opponent does get an Ulamog. Spell Skite and second bridge will keep me alive. I don't have to pull the trigger on Ghost Quarter quite yet. My opponent's going to try to grab that duress. I don't want him to have it, so now I pull the trigger on killing I. And I let my opponent have the ratchet bomb. Uh, it's kind of mean, I guess, but now he thinks he's got something to break the lock. But it's not going to happen. I still have decay in hand. So the game's over now. And opponent concedes.